Your only way out is to start life over with a new identity. If you want, I can get you the birth certificate of a child who died in 1953. It's hardly been used. No, I am not a quitter. Who's not a quitter? My dead friend Hank Hill or my new friend Rusty Shackelford? Look, just help. Give me your license. I'm going to run you through the computer. The computer? Uh, I, I don't have my license on me at the moment, uh, but I can tell you that I was born in 1953. As a child, I was quite ill. <laughs> is that a real computer? Yes. Oh, in that case, my name is Rusty Shackelford. Shackleford. How about you, Rusty? 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 Oh, Shackleford. Yes, I am pro mower. What? I like the ashtray. Don't be an idiot. Uh, uh my, my name is Shackleford. Rusty Shackleford. I refuse to speak without my attorney present. <laughs> I am Mr. Shackelford's attorney, Rusty Shackelford. My client pleads insanity. My name is Dotrieve Commabill, and I am also insane. Oh. Next. <laughs> Shackelford, Rusty. Here you go, Mr. Shackelford. Thank you. Quibble, make the check out to me. With pleasure. And your name is... Let me take this opportunity to introduce the band on keyboards, the big D himself, Rusty Shackelford. Damn, I was good. Look what I found at the library. How to blow stuff up. You're making a bomb? Several. I'm engaged in an arms race with an exterminator in McMainerberry. You could get in a lot of trouble for this, Dale. I'm pretty sure the government keeps track of books like that. At least I hope they do. You mean Rusty Shackelford could get in a lot of trouble. I have a library card in his name. Shisha! My smokes! <laughs> Thanks for the ride, Hank. If I pass out before we get to the hospital, tell them my name is Rusty Shackelford. He's got great insurance. Medicaid. This is the dumbest thing you've ever done. You could have lost a finger. A cor correction. Rusty Shackelford could have lost a finger. <sighs> Dale Gribble? Maybe. Who's asking? Rusty Shackelford. D what? It's me, Dale. B but that's impossible. Rusty died in third grade. I didn't die. I moved. You need to stop using my name, Dale. I am not using your name, and I am not Dale. Come on, Dale. You're smoking the same brand of cigarettes you did in the third grade. Get off my property, whoever I am! I, I really need to talk to Dale. I'm trying to get a small business loan, but the bank thinks I'm the same guy who skipped town on a string of failing alpaca farms. Well, if we see him, we'll give him the message. I want to handle this like gentlemen, but, well, I'm not leaving town until it's sorted out. Nice meeting you. Did you hear that? He's not leaving. <laughs> He's gonna hunt me like an animal and kill me. Like an animal. I was never here. My hedge. Go find your own. I was here first, and Hank deeded this hedge to me. He didn't want you to get it in the divorce. Shh. Are you stifle, woman? I think I hear Shackelford's car. Who's Shackelford? The man whose identity I stole. Who are you hiding from? Cozy Kitchen. The people who made our vegetable peeler? That thing's great! All I wanted was a fall guy so I'd never have to take responsibility for my actions. They're destroying my realty career. They're threatening to take everything, and I can't tell Hank about it. I don't know where to turn. Me neither. There's no escape. Maybe if I killed myself, he'd leave me alone. While you're at it, take me out too. Peggy, it would be my pleasure. Here's the story. We stole Bill's car, 
That part's true. Then we drove it into the ravine. And you think that's really going to convince people we're dead? How hard can it be? Shackelford convinced me he was dead in the third grade. It appears Bill needs to have his tires aligned. Well, Bill's gonna need a new seat. Coming! Ha-ha! <laughs> You'll never catch me, Shackelford! Help! You gotta hide me! Shackelford is on his way! Dale, if you are not here to make a purchase, I must ask you to leave. Ah, uh, then I am taking you as my hostage! Ha! No! Oh, Lord. Uh, wow, this pan's amazing. I'm riddled with tiny shrapnel, but it doesn't have a scratch on it. Ooh. Ooh. I could make one hell of a flapperjack with that, honey. Yep. We need to settle this whole identity theft issue once and for all. Oh, God, a gun. Die like a man, Gribble. Die like a man. Just sign these forms so I can get on with my life. Okay.